Shabbat Shalom from Temple Concord. This week, as you can see, I'm not at the temple at all, but I'm out in a pasture with cows, believe it or not. And we're here because this week our Torah portion teaches about the red heifer. Uh, we're instructed to go find this perfect red heifer without blemish and take that heifer and sacrifice it, and through the ashes of that animal become pure. Now the truth is, that perfect red heifer never exists. They say it existed in temple times, but we don't have any record of it. And if you look out towards the cows today, you'll see that while there are cows that have red in them, or brown in them, or white in them, or black in them, they all have speckles and they all have colors. What we learn from this is that the Bible sometimes demands perfection from us that we can't achieve. And that that perfect purity, that perfect pure cow may not be possible. But what is possible is to recognize that we all carry sanctity within us and that we can find a way to live more pure lives even if we can't reach that highest threshold. I hope to see you this Shabbat. We have our first in the summer series of services this Friday evening at six o'clock. We'll be meeting at Onondaga Lake Park, uh, not with burgers for dinner, but rather with fried chicken for dinner. Uh, and we'll have a service celebrating the 4th of July and the beginning of summer. Uh, on Saturday morning, we have Torah study at 10, followed by Shabbat services at 11. Uh, and next week, of course, we'll be closed during middle of the week for the 4th of July. For now, though, I wish you a Shabbat of peace and happiness and of recognizing that through the humble cow, we can recognize that purity is something that we can strive for, even while recognizing we may never fully achieve it. Shabbat Shalom for now. I hope to see you at the temple. Take care.